Hi guys, my name is Tremor, and I wanted to share this video because it took me a while to find a tutorial online regarding passing variables as arguments into a workflow. So with that, this should be a quick one. So I've already created a process, and all I'm doing is I've already defined three variables the first integer, the second integer, and the third integer. And I've also created a message string that says I'm learning to pass arguments into a workflow. So this first activity takes and assigns 10 to the integer 1, assigns 20 to the integer 2, and then I actually created a sequence that will calculate integer 1 and integer 2. So with that, I'm going to go ahead and open the um, workflow. And what I did is in the workflow itself, I am now, I created three arguments in the workflow. Basically, I've got argument integer 1, argument integer 2, and argument in integer 3. The first two are in, which means that's going to be passed into the workflow. And the out means that that argument will be passed outside the workflow. Okay. I'm going to close this real quick. But as you can see here, but I need to tell the art, I need to tell the workflow um, what I'm passing in. So when you get when you when you click on import arguments, what you'll see is I've assigned the argument integer to the integer one, argument integer two to integer number two and the argument integer three to integer number three. And what it will do is it will take these values on the right and pass it into the arguments inside the workflow. So when I open the workflow again, um, integer, integer number three all I'm doing is I'm adding the argument integer number one that I passed in and plus the argument integer two that I passed in, which will give me argument integer number three. I'm gonna go back to the main workflow and what that will do is it'll then pass it into the message box, which will take the message variable that I set up earlier that says I'm learning about passing arguments. And then the integer number three, which is coming from the argument, I'm uh, sorry, it's coming from the workflow. So what should happen is it should it should give me the the, the, the sum of the integer number one and integer number two after it's calculated in the, the workflow. So with that, I'll get and run it for you. There you go. Pretty simple. Um, I'm gonna put it out there so that people can learn. It took me a while to figure that one out. Thanks guys.